last four months of being uh, London's parents and being a family have been amazing. Truly amazing. There's uh, the odd thing that you do, I'll <laughs> say, is you start to talk very... I was at the store uh. the other day and the lady said, hey, which one of these do you want? I was like, mommy, which one of these do you want? Yeah. I was like, oh, that sounded that really sounded weird. weird. Like we call each other mommy and daddy now and out in public and we forget about it. Or I It's not so different from you because you've always called me daddy. I've always called him big daddy, but that was more in private, never out loud. <laughs> Now I get to officially call you daddy out loud and in front of others and it's not awkward. <laughs> well, actually it is awkward, still. <laughs> yeah, it, you're just calling me daddy now. There's no big daddy in there anymore. Yeah, that's, that's afterwards. Yeah, you gotta get the big back in there. We're going to Canada with London for a dance convention called Triple Threat. It's a friend of ours, her name is Kelly Kono. She used to dance for Janet Jackson and she's originally a Canadian, so she started a dance convention up there. Good friends, so we're going up to support. London's been traveling with us, so why not? Let's bring London to Canada. But I didn't realize that, like at his age, he'd have to have a passport. Anyway, we have to go through this process now. So a little extra work just to take this trip before the actual work of the trip happens. Passport. Got to fly to Canada. In total, in order to get London's passport to travel for two work days, it took me three days of actual activities. Going to get our passport, honey. One trip to get the birth certificate, another trip to go get the passport. Mm -hmm. Even going to take the picture. Oh, yeah. Have you ever tried to put a three month old who can't sit up? You're not going to be able. How's he going to do that? Hold him in the back to have a little. Ready? There we go. Follow the camera. There you go. What do you do? I'm trying to hold them, and then they're like, you can't have your hand in the picture. So finally, we just grabbed the white cardboard thing, put it on the ground, and then laid them on the ground. middle of Kinko's with our baby on the floor on this piece of white paper and the guy is trying to take a picture of him. And that leads to super ugly pictures. He uh, looks like Angry Bird. You know, I feel bad for London because that picture is probably the fattest picture that we've ever taken of London and now he's stuck with it until he's probably like 13, 14 years old with his passport. Hey! Hello. You got the passport? You can be a world traveler now. Look at this guy, look at this guy's mug. Let me see your fingers covering it. Whoa, chunky boy. He is huge, his picture, he, I mean, does this even look What's like What's that, him? chunky boy? Does that even look like you? A little bit. <laughs> no, it doesn't. It doesn't? I think you've lost weight. Let's keep on moving, okay? All right, let's do it. Okay, that's his, this is the sun outside, you see it? This is what my wife wants the baby to wear. Hello. <laughs> well, those gloves are huge. They're huge. I know, but at least they'll keep them warm. We're going to Canada, Dad, and we heard it's snowing. This is the last load up thing. We'll be good. All right, London, I can barely see you with all the bags in the car. Here we go. You'd imagine going on an international flight, you're going to be on a huge 757. Oh, yeah. You'll. No. We were on a little two seater, two by two. Problem with this two by two seater is if you've never been on one, the back of it has a really tiny bathroom, but you literally can't stand up in the bathroom, it's tiny. The other part for us with Tabitha is no there's changing no changing station. table. When that sign comes on at 10,000 feet, that's London's sign to take a big old crap. Yes, that's what he blows it Because as soon as 15 out. minutes in a flight, <laughs> as soon as that thing dings, he craps. Napoleon and I in this emergency are like, what are we going to do? I had to literally turn around, face my seat, put London in the chair and try to take his clothes off, change his diaper. There's nothing about not having a changing table on a plane is all right. Nothing. That's, if I was by myself, ooh and I would have had to ask the flight attendant. I would have been like, excuse me, ma'am, you have to help me change my son's diaper. I couldn't have done it by she myself. She would have probably. I probably would. Nice. Yeah, they were nice, but still. You know them Canadians, they're super nice. Yeah. They help with everything. <laughs> In Canada, I'm hoping not to get 
fat. Because what happens on these trips for me is you're in the airport, you have no other choice but to eat horrible food. It's mm -hmm. not like I'm gonna find a juicer there. And then you get to the hotel rooms and it's late and you order room service. So beside the dancing, I also have to work out. And, and let's face it, I don't dance that much when I'm no. teaching. I have to say, as you know, your fans have been complaining a little bit. That they That's right. They've you. been doing that for 18 years on YouTube. <laughs> you won't see me dancing on YouTube anywhere. No. I really don't. I, I teach a lot and then I turn around and you watch to be able to watch instruct. and instruct. Otherwise, it's just like we're dancing up there trying to show off and it's not what teaching is about. I feel like I have to look them in the eye and Tabitha is so good. So I usually let her do all the dancing and I do the instructing. Well, we're hitting the road for a creative meeting in Las Vegas with the Jabberwockies, only this time, London's taking you for the ride. Hey, everybody. Comment below. If you leave some comments and give us your advice, we might learn a few things. And if you like the show, please let me know. My mom and dad are working really, really hard to do this show. And they're, 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 they love me. <laughs> Being sexy isn't all about looks. Watch Carrie Riley uncover the sexiest parts of Amanda Russell. Megan's journey's going strong, but she has to step it up to beat this next obstacle. See if she can finish her first 5K here. Nappy tabs aren't the only ones getting down in Boston. Check out Baby London as he puts his twist on shake, rattle, and roll. Men's health trainer David Jack guides you on a 30-second total body workout. How many rounds can you handle? Subscribe for more health tips. Your body will thank you.